Hi, Larry Parman with the estate and elder law planning firm of Parman and Easterday. Today you find me standing in beautiful Tel Aviv on the beach. Beautiful city to my right, or your left. Beautiful Mediterranean Sea to my left. In 1984, I started this farm because of an experience I had in my own family. Of my dad dying underneath the tractor without an estate plan. That changed my whole paradigm about the importance of creating an estate plan. Not only did I start my firm and build it to become one of the most successful in the Midwest, I co-authored two books on estate planning. Tel Aviv, as I understand it, was a city started from scratch on the Israeli coast of the Mediterranean in about 1908 or 1909 by 12 founding families. It's a gorgeous city. It's a very high technology area. It's the seat of their business community, their innovation center. Some of the statistics about Israel and their economy are quite amazing. But that's not really what I want to mention to you today. When you're in Israel, you start thinking about the history, and you think about the legacy. You think about the challenges of the people who occupy this wonderful land. You think about what they've done in terms of taking a desert and turning it into one of the most productive. Excuse me just a minute. Hold on. Keep it running, Scott. We're getting a little instruction from the lifeguard. So when you think about this land and you think about the challenges the people of this land have had to endure through the ages, it causes one to once again think about legacy. And when we think about legacy, we start thinking about those values, those attributes, those character traits, if you will, that we choose and want to pass on to the generations that follow us. It's impossible to escape here. It's a huge part of their culture. In America, it's just a little bit different. But in our estate planning practice, we talk about legacy a lot. So as you think about what you've done regarding your estate planning and the message you've delivered to your family through the steps that you've taken so far, and perhaps the steps you've not yet taken, what kind of message are you leaving about your legacy? Because you see, like it or not, how we treat the financial part of our life leaves a message. And that message becomes part of our legacy. And don't get me wrong. There are many other more important things than money in terms of creating a legacy. But if that's part of your life and if that's part of what you need to do for the benefit of yourself while you're living, and let's not forget that, but also your children, be sure to take the steps that you need to take today to start making some foundational decisions about the legacy that you will leave your family. Creating an estate plan is a wonderful start in that process. And certainly not the end, it's the beginning because that plan has to be kept updated. Your life changes, the law changes, our recommendations about all those things change. And so it's a process, it's not an event. Anyway, we invite you to come visit our firm, Armin and Easter Day, for your complimentary consultation about how you can start the journey of leaving a legacy.